eating and uh, now we can head to the supercharger so we're going to navigate to the charging and i'm just filtering out the fastest one so fastest one we have here 150 kilowatt which is 6.9 miles away and is 0.34 per kilowatt hour so tesla battery is pretty huge so you gotta see like how much you're willing to pay going here or you can actually go here both are 150 kilowatt max charging but this one is cheaper by five cents this one expensive five cents but i would rather go to this one because this one is 250 kilowatt and it's 32 cents so it's right in the middle but it's faster charging or i can go to the kt1 which is uh, 32 cents per kilowatt it's faster and i think if i go there it's gonna be nearby my house so this is decisions but i mean you gotta make sure you decide on the basis of the charging speed and per kilowatt hour charging so, Katie, so 250 watt and when we get there we're gonna charge and see if there are other people charging what is their reaction because a lot of people want to take picture they want to see what's inside because a lot of tesla centers they're not showing from inside they're just showing from the outside uh, they don't allow you to open the doors or uh, get inside so we're gonna let some people do that why not right so hit the like on this video and i'll see you on the other side so we are just uh, two minutes away from reaching this charging station it's uh, at bucky's i really like it here because you can go and you know use the cleanest restrooms in texas you can grab something to buy to eat and meanwhile your car is being charged so i'm gonna see how much uh, time it takes charge uh, how much time does it take to charge from i have 38 percent remaining right now and on 38 percent it says there are 122 miles remaining so let's pull up to these slots right here they're all 250 kilowatt chargers and um, it's gonna be 32 cents per kilowatt for the charging so that depends if we have any space available this is pretty busy right here because it's like um, you know this is the bucky so a lot of people stop here use restrooms you know um, so let's see and i don't want to park next to somebody so most probably i'm gonna do it here away from i always keep like one uh keep around like one spot distance so uh, let's see really bad at the bad at parking this truck at the moment but i like the lines over there that shows me you know how i'm going so straight 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 there right there right there don't want to hit that thing in the back oh wow i think it's pretty good so we're gonna go and plug it in it's 38 percent we had 5 15 p.m and uh, let's see how it's gonna be for charging so let's put it in the park okay so if you see the cable is pretty short for the 250 kilowatt and uh, even if you go to 150 so it's not gonna reach because usually charging is right here for your model x and model y charging is somewhere around this area so you can plug it in easily but for this to be here i think i'm gonna have to back up a little more so we'll do that So I think I'm pretty close, but the cable is pretty short. So we're going to see if it can reach. So yeah, it does reach. And remember, 38% charge, 516 now. So there we go. Now let's see how fast it does for the charging. We preconditioned that already. So hopefully it's going to be doing faster. okay so i have plugged in the charging it's doing it at the you know 71 kilowatt it's gonna keep going uh, higher i'm not next to anyone so that is vacant charger there so it's supposed to charge it faster and uh, yeah it's climbing up about you know 400 500 miles per hour sometimes i see on my tesla model y like thousand miles per hour but then the thing is my car is at five percent or ten percent battery this is at like 39 now 38 we started charging so time is about 517 and uh, we're gonna go use the uh, bucky's restroom and come back in maybe like uh, 20 minutes to see how fast it charges up to uh, i'm gonna charge up to 80 percent so it's 40 already and uh, we'll see how long does it take so thank you so much for watching this video guys really appreciate it how long have you had it?
barely got it just yesterday. It or but then the thing is when you when you're touching it, like my kind of hand sweaty, you uh -huh. leave the fingerprints everywhere. Okay, so we've been here for about a um, little over 18 minutes and now it says 10 minutes more remaining to get to 80% charge because as soon as you go, you know, the higher battery charging rate, the charging rate drops. So it has dropped to 77 kilowatt, but this is enough for us to you know, go about our day and I have the charger at home so I don't have to worry about, you know, um, just charging here to the full 80%, but 70 is good. I'm gonna unplug and see how much uh, money they have charged me to charge from, you know, the 38% to all the way up to 70% and uh, yeah, let's do that. Okay, so I have unplugged that and uh, let's see what it talks about. So I'm gonna go to the charging here and so the last charge is here. It's kind of free right now. I don't know, or maybe it's gonna take some time. I plugged it in at 519 and it's 538. So that's about uh, 19 minutes, about 20 minutes. And it says zero here. So maybe I'll give it some time for it to update and it shows, you know, the last paid, how much it is. But right now it's zero. Maybe they are not charging me. I'm not pretty sure about it, but maybe I can put it in the drive and go back to the charging to see if it is updated no it still shows zero uh no actually it's updated so if you see right here it cost me total ten dollars and 56 cents to charge from 38 percent to 70 percent um so that's pretty good i charge about let me take out my calculator because uh doing this video for the full day um kind of brain is slowing down but let's say I was at the 38%, I charged it at 70%, so that's about 32% I charged, and it cost me $10.56, so multiply by three, that's 96%. So it's about like 32, $33 that I paid here, 32 cents per kilowatt charging. Uh, which is pretty good. I mean, if you are driving a V8 engine, you would be putting in gas for 80 bucks. But here it's about $32 to charge the car for full 100%. It's going to take time, but it's going to do it. And you're going to save money on even the supercharging. So $32, $33 and I'm in the Texas. That's why we have Bucky's here. Bucky's is solely in Texas. It's a pretty good place. You come here, you have so many charging spots and they're always working. So that's all I have from this video, guys. And let me know in the comment section what else you want to see. And I'll see you in another one. Until then, peace out.